Hey, what's up guys? It's Mr. Allen C. And today we're going to be doing another Jesus Calling video. This is a daily devotional out of the book Jesus Calling. First we'll have the author's interpretation of some Bible verses, and then we'll read the supporting Bible verses. So here's the author's interpretation and spin on it. Now this is supposed to be Jesus speaking, and it's the author writing it as if she's Jesus, like she's trying to say what he's saying through these Bible verses. Refresh yourself in peace of my presence. This peace can be your portion at all times and in all circumstances. Learn to hide in the secret of my presence, even as you carry your duties in the world. So you guys are busy, you got duties to take care of out here in the world, but while you're doing that, you can hide in the secret of Jesus' presence. Now, we don't want to keep Jesus a secret, but guess what? You can lean on him and you can keep that secret. And uh, it's something you can really enjoy. I go before you to open up the way, and I also walk alongside you. There could never be another companion as devoted as I am. Because I am your constant companion, there should be no lightness to your step that is observable to others. Do not be weighed down with problems and unresolved issues, for I am your burden bearer. Jesus is your burden bearer, guys. And let me get a better grip on this book here. Okay, Jesus is a burden bearer. In the world you have trials and distress, but don't let them get you down. I have conquered the world. That's right, Jesus has conquered the world and deprived it of power to harm you. In me you may have confidence and peace. So Jesus overcame the world, and let me tell you, the world's a lot better than it was before Jesus came, and he's really deprived it of its power to deprive you. All right, here's the supporting Bible verses now. Psalms 31, 19 through 20. And this is special to me because I love God with all my heart, and I encourage you guys to uh, get to know him. How great is your goodness, which you have stored up for those who fear you, which you have wrought for those who take refuge in you before the sons of men. You hide them in secret place of your presence from the conspiracies of man. The man's full of all sorts of conspiracies and all the all these rules around you, they're just made up by man. I mean, you want to follow your government rules, but you got to remember, this is a world dictated by men right now that we're living in. It's not Jesus' rules. Uh, but Jesus does say in the Bible to follow your government. Follow his word and then follow your government's local government. Okay, as as long as it doesn't contradict his word. Or is immoral. So where were we? You keep them secretly in shelter from the strife of tongues. So that, that Bible verse kind of backs up that Jesus keeps you in secret from strife. Keeps you in shelter from strife. So get Jesus in your life, guys. Uh, second Bible verse, last one here, John sixteen thirty three. I have told you these things so that in me you may have perfect peace and confidence. In the world you have tribulation and trials and distress and frustration, but be of good cheer. Guys, take courage and be confident, certain, undaunted, for Jesus has overcome the world. It says, for I have overcome the world. I have deprived it of the power to harm you and have conquered it for you. Absolutely true. And that's John 16.33, guys. Take a minute, say a prayer, connect with Jesus, and uh, we can always do prayer requests or pray together. If you have any, leave them in the comments. I'll hit you next video uh, with the prayer. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Please do hit that thumbs up button and help get God's word out there and these daily devotions. I'm going to try to keep doing them. If I keep getting views, I really appreciate you guys. Bye-bye.